I'm Mike Frankel in Richland for a non-public showdown between St. Augustine and Holy Spirit. A lot on the line in this one. In fact, the winner moves on to the West Jersey Football League's top pod to face Williamstown next week. The loser tonight also advancing to a West Jersey Football League pod, but it will be a secondary pod to face Hamilton. First quarter and the Hermits bust out a trick play early. Nasir Hill on the end around and he's going up top. Hill connects with Kenny Selby. That's a 50 yard pickup on the play. And St. Augustine is in business. Later in the drive, the Hermits keep it on the ground with Kanye Udo. Udo through the hole for a first down and more. The Spartans bring him down inside the five, but not before a 20 yard gain. First and goal Hermits. But on the next play, the ball comes loose. Michael Weaver with the fumble recovery for Spirit. And the Spartans take over. No score after one. Second quarter, Patrick Smith on the carry. And watch Cheeks work. Breaks one, two, three tackles before he gets to the sideline and races all the way in for a 39-yard touchdown run. Smith decommitting from Colorado State just this week. Power five college football likely in his future. The extra point fails, but Cheeks gives Spirit a 6-0 lead. Later in the second, fourth and short for the Spartans inside the red zone. A chance to add to the lead before halftime. Instead, Trey McClear picks off the pass at the five-yard line. McClear with a clutch takeaway for St. Augustine. And it's still a 6-0 game at the break. Third quarter and the Spartans return the favor with another takeaway. A Johnny Rembert punches this ball loose. CJ Egri with the recovery. And the Spirit defense holds. But a few plays later, the prep defense gets the ball right back. Brandon Jones able to strip the football loose. McClear dives on top of it. Points hard to come by in this one, but both defenses forcing multiple turnovers. It's still a 6-0 game with five minutes to go in the fourth quarter. McLear airs it out to Hill, and the Sear Hill is gone. 67 yards to Pater. St. Augustine's first points of the night tie the game at six. Brandon Bispo would add an extra point to give the Hermits a 7-6 lead. Here come the Spartans right back. A good kickoff return from Jameer Smith sets Spirit up at the Hermits 40. Trevor Cohen to Gavin Roman. An over the shoulder catch in tight coverage and he tumbles in for the touchdown. A 40 yard strike from Cohen to Roman. And with that, Spirit is back on top 12 to seven. Still a few minutes left for the Hermits to work with. McLear hits Hill again. Nasir Hill on the run inside the 30, inside the 20. Finally brought down just shy of the 15 yard line. First down prep. All right, 40 seconds left, fourth and short for St. Augustine. This is the ball game. A throw to the end zone and the Spartans have it covered. Holy Spirit knocks off the Hermits on the road to punch a ticket to the top playoff pod in the West Jersey Football League. 12 to seven the final. The Spartans earn the right to play in an unofficial South Jersey Championship semifinal next week. Coming into this game, we were uh, preparing for it for two weeks and we knew they were bigger than us, we knew they were stronger than us, we just came out and played harder and out schemed them. It means a lot, you know, we worked so hard from the beginning of the season. Um, we knew that this the short season that we had to just go out with a banger, you know. Um, so this whole week of practice has just been preparing to, um, for this game and I, our defense did a phenomenal job all week in practice and it showed today on the, on the game field. You don't really deserve to be in anything, you got to earn it. And uh, we talked to our team that it was a playing game for us, uh, and they had to come out and play hard. This was an opportunity for us to be one of the top four teams in South Jersey. And they took that to heart. They worked hard all week, and they had an opportunity to do that, and they took advantage of it today. So Spirit will host Williamstown in that top WJFL pod next week. The Spartans are now 5-0. and The Hermits drop to 3-2. and They'll host Hamilton in another pod next week. In Richland, I'm Mike Frankel, JerseySportsZone.com.